Hello and welcome to tutorial number two in the Group Jive 3.0 series. In our first tutorial, we basically installed uh, the Group Jive elements and quickly created a couple of categories and groups <coughs> from our back end panel. Uh, I've added more, more groups here for this tutorial and I've also added another uh, menu item which is called I call it group chive all language so basically it shows us all of the language all the groups in the language category uh, let's just show you how I did this I went to the back end menus in my main menu basically I created a new menu called group chive all language and let me just show you what I did here Again, it's the Community Builder plugin, CB Group Chive. Uh, the action is now the category action. And in the ID field, I put the ID of the category in Group Chive that I want to show. And ID number one, if I take a look at uh, the Group Chive categories list, I'll see that ID number one is my languages category. So the result basically is a CB a a group chive all languages uh, menu item, which basically shows you shows me the category canvas, the category logo, and underneath all the groups that are in this category. Okay, let me just take this a step further now. I'm not logged in, and let's just look at, for example, the Greek uh, language. Uh, I'm seeing that the only thing I see here is just the users tab. I'm not seeing any of the other tabs because there's nothing to show and I'm not logged in so I can't join and I can't actually contribute to this group. If I go to another group, for example, the group chive group, again, I'm not logged in, but in this group, I see more tabs. I see the event tab, files, photos, videos, and the reason I'm seeing these tabs is because there's content in them. The videos tab, I've linked a video for the first tutorial. The wall, Susan started a wall post here. Uh, photos, I have two photos that have, have been uploaded here. <coughs> files, there's one of the file that's uploaded, and I've also created an event here, so a guest user has access to see all this information. If I log in, uh, Susan, for example, and stay in this group, I'll see a new event, files, photos, video. See, I have a new button here. Basically, since I'm already, Susan is already a member of this group here and Susan basically can start uh, new elements in each one of these tabs okay one thing that I didn't do yesterday in the first tutorial and the result is I'm not seeing a forums tab is I didn't integrate the uh, forums plugin correctly so let me just go back and show you what I did go to community builder plugin management <coughs> and find the forums plugin and in the parameters model make sure Kunena is, is selected it's the only thing it found and the categories you have to basically from a drop down select which Kunena category uh, you want group chive to create its discussion groups under. So I've created a new one here called Group Jive Group Discussions in Kunena. And just to save and close. Okay, now what I wanna do is in the categories, each category basically, CB add-ons category, as you can see, the this forms category is selected, CB add-ons. But if I create a new category here, 
I want to make sure that the category configuration in the forum sub tab here is also new category. What this will do basically is if done correctly, it'll create um, a hierarchy of categories. And so let me just show you what the result is in Kunena, Kunena forum categories. We'll see that uh, we've created this category here, group jive group discussions from Kunena, but everything else is automatically created by group jive. Okay, so let's go back to the front end again. At this point, we're not seeing a forums tab. So what we have to do is go to the group jive back end, find the group jive group here, and just make sure that the integrations forums tab is set to new category. And let's just do a save here. That's enough. Now from here on, when I create new groups, I don't have to bother with this because it'll automatically be done correctly. So we see when we did the save, there's a new category in Kunena created called Group Jive. And if I refresh the front end, I should see a new tab here, forums. And if I do a new post here, I'm basically sent uh, to the Kunena area where I can post. This access denied is a small bug here that'll be fixed in the next RC. But basically you get the point. If I log in, I, if, if I, uh, since I'm a member now, uh, I can see the structure here, CB group jive. There's a languages category and a CB add-ons category. I'm not seeing anything else below because I'm not a member of any one of these uh, uh, forum areas. If I log out and log in as my admin, okay, and then check the Kunena area here. Let me just go to the Kunena forums and look at the index here. There we go. So I see there's a group jive discussions category and underneath we have a test discussion group for our test group. And there are two other categories, which is languages. And under the languages, I have a number of subgroups here, Japanese, Russian, and Greek. And under the CB add-ons category, I have a discussion group for group jive. I'm seeing this all because I'm a super admin. Um, if I log in as a regular user, I will only see what I'm allowed to access as a group jive uh, user. Okay, I'm stopping here for this tutorial. Thank you for listening. Stay tuned for our next tutorial. Bye-bye.